The Folk Art Guild was established in Middlesex in 1967 as an intentional community with the aim of helping the development of balanced people and has continued the age-old tradition of handcrafts and agriculture. Amidst the practicalities of daily life and the challenges and joys of living in community, these streams come together. Ceramics was an early piece of this experiment focusing primarily on the production of beautiful and functional wear. While going through different phases of potters teaching and producing work, the studio has continued the practice of marking all the pieces made here anonymously, without a personal signature, and instead using the stamp of the guild. I love to watch people growing with their clay and to me the learning about kill building is another part of the whole process of an education of a potter. opportunity to build a wood kill and fire with it would be a wonderful way to pull our strengths and bring our hands, brains, and hearts together. At this moment, the practicing potters in the studio would like to build an efficient, fast-fire wood kill as a means to sustainably produce their work. This is seen as an organic continuation of their efforts to explore using local materials, clays, and glazes. The wood kill would become a critical piece in the creation of an ecologically-minded product, as well as allowing people here now and in the future to deepen their sense of process. The last two years I've learned how to throw um, and how to fire the kilns which has actually been one of my favorite parts about working in pottery. So there's something in the, the labor that goes all the way through from the beginning, from the gathering of the clay, the mixing of the clay, to making the pot and it's, it's like a thread of attention can go through all the processes. And when we are able to fire with wood, which this kill will allow, we, it's almost like a full circle of completing that process of hand-thrown, handmade. It's quite lovely. It's not that what we do now isn't handmade and home-thrown and all that stuff, but having the, the labor involved in the wood kill and the fact that we're using our own wood, our own resources, is quite beautiful to me. Thank you. 